I didn't know he'd been here. No, but Katie, that's the name of the new Batman film, Batman Returns. Oh. You know who Batman is? The Caped Crusader, the Black yes. Knight of Gotham City. Look, he looks like this, the top guy. And he always has a weird grimace on his face like this. Yeah, have you seen his costume? Poor fellow, he's thinking, how on Zarb, what do I do if I want to go to the toilet? <laughs> Steal. Mm. Oh, what is it? Something has happened to your eyes. They're only slices of cucumber skin. Cal says they're very good for tired eyes and great in sandwiches. Oh, well, I was just wondering, Steele, if you would like to listen to some uh, music. Oh, no. Then we have been listening to music all week, dancing to music all week, and trying to make music all week. Right now, I am tired and would just like to rest. And I can really respect that wish, Steele. I really can. Thank I you. Really. Steel, I, I, I'm what sorry. is it? I'm sorry. I just wondered if you, uh, if you fancy a, a bop. Oh, I'll give you a bop. There. Think so? What? I, I think you've possibly misunderstood what Cal told you to do with cucumbers. Go away. I'm tired. <gasps> oh, all right. Uh, but I'm leaving you with a peace offering. Uh, uh, something I hold very dear, something that's been in my family for generations, and something which, under normal circumstances, I'd be very reluctant to part with. <laughs> this week's Batman comic. <laughs> and some soothing music to calm your cucumbers. <laughs> Hey, Batman. The Crept's Crustacean. Oh, I love superheroes. I remember the time when I saw my planet's greatest superhero in action. Captain Zarb. Ba -ba -ba. Swooping through the sky in his Zarb copter. Pow! Sock! Crunch! Spidigongi! Well, maybe not Spidigongi. But he rounded up a vicious gang of litterbugs. Muscles rippling, fists and teeth flying. It was great. <gasps> Captain Zarb. Ba -ba -ba. He makes Batman look like Kermit the Frog. The <gasps> skin man. <laughs> Do you know, I've noticed that on Earth you have so many heroes. You've got Batman, Superman, uh, Ed the Duck, uh, 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 and on my planet, Thorb. But we only have one, Captain Zorb. Zarb. Captain Zarb, that's his name, a champion of the cosmos. Oh, and what a hero. Oh, he's a tall, athletic, brilliant in intelligence, and, oh, the best dental work you've ever seen. I wish you could meet him. I really do. Hey, wait a minute. Perhaps you can. Hey, Makita! Makita! Quiet, Ma please. Oh. Have respect for my ears and my eyebrows. I'm sorry, Makita. I was just wondering if you would summon to Parallel 9 the, the champion of the cosmos. Ed the Duck? No, 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 not Ed the Duck. Captain Zar. Never, 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 never. Oh, what exactly are you trying to say? I am saying in no conceivable way would I ever allow that meddlesome snarf nibbler to even have space on the same planet as me. And as a prince of the royal blood, I command you, skin of Thorb, never even mention that person's name again. I think I can take that as a no. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> 
my hero. Tope, am I going crazy, or do I sense the presence of another Zarbian on Parallel 9? You are quite right, Mercator. But don't worry, it is merely... Thank you. Captain Zarb, at your service. Stuttering Starfields, I can't believe it. Yes, it's he, Captain Zarb. <laughs> Thank you. Good to see you, cousin. You haven't uh. changed a bit. Say, do you remember when I used to always beat you at Zarbian mind wrestling? <laughs> How could I forget? Oh, it feels like ages since I saw you. Say, you know, it's a real shame that they send you to this grotty place for messing about with time. <laughs> hey, you got any damsels? Damsels? Yeah, sure. I like to rescue a couple of damsels in distress every morning just to keep my hand in. <laughs> Kids, don't try that at home. <laughs> damsels in distress? I know, I know, I'm addicted. Yeah, usually 10 or 15 a day, but recently I've tried to cut down. We don't have any distressed damsels around oh, here. Oh, that's a pity. Hey, would you like me to fight for your release? Captain Zarb versus the Time Barons? No, thank you. Because it'd be really good if you could come back to Zarb. Hey, you know, they've named a town after me. <laughs> Zarb Town. <laughs> Used to be called Mercatorville or something. Oh, sorry. <laughs> didn't think, well, I gotta go. You know, uh, I like to run at least 300 macrons every day, as I'm sure you do yourself. See you later, Mercator. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> oh. Oh. Are you in distress? Are my letters like? <laughs> Mercator? Oh. Is that who I think it was? Yes, and the worst part is I can't get rid of him. Why not? He's another Zarbian. I can't send him back unless he wishes to be sent, or unless I could best him in combat. Well, how did he get here? A good question. So, do you have any ideas about this? Dum dee dum 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 dum. <laughs> Thank you. A damsel in distress. Bogren, name what? Bogren, name are you doing? <laughs> you. You. What in Stogren's name do you think you're doing? Saving you, oh, fair one. Uh, don't give me any of that space debris. I don't need you to look after me. No, that's not what she used to say. Then how about my trusty teenage sidekick, Zarboy? <laughs> I don't need anyone to look after me. Now out before I really lose my temper. Oh, please. Out! I think you best do as she says, because although you're all powerful, you're no match for steel when she's got the grumps. Yes, but she's a bit of a tiger when she's angry, isn't she? Yes. Okay, enchante, madame. Oh, I don't think that you can get round me by slobbering all over my knuckles. Now go away! You heard us, our boy! Yes, go sir! Go away! Yes, sir! I meant both of you. Our boy! Yes, sir! Wait for me! Yes, sir! <laughs> what are you doing? I'm Zar boy, so I'm zuzzing. Z -z 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 well, zuzz up! Sorry. Gee, I don't understand it, Zar boy. Usually women fall over themselves for me. Oh, really? Yes. Oh, you meet a lot of one legged women in your line of business, then, do you? No, I mean, never mind. Bring Kato. Please, Captain Zarb to you. Very well, Captain Zarb. I hereby challenge you to a duel. A duel? Yes, I can't stand you being here a moment longer, and as I know you won't leave without a fight. True. <laughs> I always like a good bundle. So be it then. My princely magic against your superpowers. You remember we had such a duel the last time we met. <laughs> the loser had to run stark naked through the streets of Zarbtown. Oh, sorry. Mercadaville, as it was then known. <laughs> I remember. Yes, he caught quite a nasty cold that night, you know. Well, you would, wouldn't you, if you yes. ran... Oh, okay. shut up. Sorry. This time, Rinkata, and for the first time, I shall best you. I'm afraid you won't, but if you do... You will agree to leave Parallel 9 never to a return. And if I... when? Then you can have my royal titles. Captain Prince Zarb. <laughs> Thank you. I like it. Very well, let's do it. Meet me at the Tope, at when 15 Macrons have passed, and may the best Zarbian win. Uh, wouldn't you rather win, Mercator? Oh, shut up. Oh, Zar boy, yes. I leave yes. you. I have to go and prepare for battle. Oh, 
Good luck, Captain Zub. Oh, there's nothing like a superhero. And that was nothing like a superhero. <laughs> Mind you, if you like a superhero, you will be batty about a film that opened this week. It's called Batman Returns. <laughs> Batman Returns, which went on general release yesterday. And this is Louisa. What did you think of it, Lucy? I thought it was brilliant. I thought it was absolutely good. All the time there's action. I really enjoyed it. And what's the story about? Well, it's about two villains, the Penguin and Catwoman, and they want to take over Gotham City. So Batman, of course, saves the day. And the Penguin character, did you uh, feel sorry for him? Well, at the beginning, when he was looking for his parents and couldn't find them, I felt really sorry for him. But at the end, when he's all gruesome and ugly, I didn't like him. Well, let's have a look at him. Uh, this is a clip uh, with Danny DeVito, who plays a penguin, when he meets uh, another evil character, Max Schreck. And uh, for film buffers everywhere, Max Schreck was a, a tribute to a character in an early vampire film called Nosferatu. And Schreck means terror. Odd as it may seem, Max, you and I have something in common. We're both perceived as monsters. But somehow, you're a well-respected monster, and I am, to date, not. Frankly, I feel it's a bum rap. I'm a businessman. Tough, yes. Shrewd, okay. But that does not make me a monster. Don't embarrass yourself, Max. I know all about you. What you hide, I discover. What you put in your toilet, I place on my mantle. Get the picture. What is that supposed to hypnotize me? No. Just give you a splitting headache. <sighs> Louisa, what was your favorite bit? Well, I liked the beginning when he was just a baby and the parents didn't like him. So they threw him over the river and he sort of floated down into the sewers where the penguins found him. So that was really good. Oh, well, that, that that's, uh, leads me to my favorite bit. My favorite bit was when the penguin said, uh, I think the word you're looking for is... So that was great. And, and how does it compare, do you think, to Batman 1? Well, the first one was really good, but the second was even better. I like that a lot. Good. Well, that is uh, Louisa's recommendation. Batman Returns is better than Batman 1. Oh, I want love. I need love.
able to make mind, body and soul invincible LSI getting high like adrenaline Pure as diamond, cool and crystalline LSI love sex intelligence Coming on like a seven That's why I carry on And my mom's who's strong So hold on Know that this is the one I need your love But no sense of no fuss LSI is the bond between us And I like you like that Without any pretense I need your love Sexual intelligence My LSI is all that you require Your LSI It is my heart's desire Together we are strong enough To carry on And on and on Love your contest with Zabo and I've come to wish you all the best of luck. Thank you, Steele. Perhaps you'd like to stay and watch the duel. Uh, well, will it be loud? Probably. Well, in that case, I'll give it a miss, but if Zabo gives you any trouble, mm. let me know and I'll smash his stupid face in. Oh, most kind. No chance. Well, you don't, you can't leave now. In the case of our of need, he well, needs a support. Well, can't I support him from home No, now? you can't. Take that. <sighs> and... N-E-R-C-A-T-O-R, Makata! <laughs> By Askbar's tomb! <gasps> <laughs> nice try, Makata. Now try this. By Ezekiel's elbows! <laughs> Alas, Paul Zah boy, I knew you well. <laughs> my spell casting is better than my aim. Nice try, Makeda. Now get a load of this. <laughs> I knew it was going to be loud! Captain Zah's breath is so strong! Keep up the garlic! <laughs> Oh, I feel absolutely foul. Oh, shut your beak. Very good, Makeda. Not many Zarbians can take my breath. Mirth in my nose, and now, by Kaigul's kneecap, let me say your lower limbs shall run away. My legs! Where are my legs? <laughs> They've gone out to stretch themselves. You can have them back if you concede defeat. Makeda, I salute you. You have bested me in combat. I concede. <laughs> I win, I win. Yeah! M-E-R-C-A-T-O-R, Mercator! Quite the feat, cousin. <laughs> and talking of feet... Thank you. Well, I gotta go. I've got a black hole to fill. And I'm going shopping as soon as I get back home. And after lunch... Goodbye, cousin. Well done, Makeda. I knew the best man won. Yes, well done, Makeda. I knew oh. you'd do it. Was, he, was it wise to let him live? Oh, I won, I won, auspicious day. I feel like dancing. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>